Hey, what's up everybody? How are you doing? Uh, today we are gonna do something special for you guys. I think a couple of you, a couple of you have requested um, that we do this, uh, and it's a backflip tutorial. Ethan's gonna teach you guys how to do backflip, and in order to do that, he's gonna um, pretty much I'm I'm a trial, and I've never I haven't learned a backflip on the ground yet, so he's gonna teach me as well as teach you at the same time. So we better see how it goes. But uh, yeah, I guess the first thing we need to do probably is to. What, like, what's the first rule? A mattress. A mattress? Well, what do you mean by a mattress? Now that you have a mattress, oh, he's gonna do a flip. I that wasn't a flip. It. I don't know I'm what he's trying to do. I'm but now that you have your go. mattress, uh... All right, guys, it's thunderstorming, so we, we about to make this fast and easy and good. So, uh, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna start videotaping Eli. Okay, go. All right, so, you know, you, you obviously want to be able to do a backflip on the trampoline before you can take it to the ground, you know? Or either like a spring floor. It's just you have to know what a backflip feels like before you start on the ground. Which I already know how to do. Very well, yes. So, after you can backflip on a trampoline and do a foam pit, it doesn't matter what, after you can do a backflip. So, since it's, you know, like on a trampoline. So, same thing for the um, mattress, right? So, you wanna make sure you go up. So that's your, that's your height. And then you wanna throw your head back and throw your, like, your, uh, what do these call your knees to your chest. So that's automatically gonna get you to fall back. The higher you go, and honestly, practice it on something bouncy first, just to know how a backflip feels. So I'm just gonna show you one real fast. So, arms up, you're gonna wanna go down, arms back, so you can throw them up for height and, like, power. And then you're, you're gonna bring your knees into your chest and huck it and just hold that tight ball for a backflip. I'll show you one on the, on the mattress. So there's, there's a mattress. So after you can do that, since it's raining, we're making this fast, I guess. Um, you're gonna wanna go to the end, the end of the uh, mattress, have your heels about just, like just about to almost fall off because then you can like jump out and all that jazz. So it's honestly easier jumping off of it because it's lower to the ground like by a few centimeters. So you're gonna wanna go up, tuck, and then flip back, right? Oh crap. It's really easy if you know what it feels like on a trampoline, because this is also bouncy, but you're also landing on ground, which helps it, which like helps you. So. Oh, it actually is bouncy, that's crazy. Yeah, it's, it, mattresses are bouncy, because there's springs in them, Jacob. So it's the I didn't know thing. that they do. Yeah, so it's the same thing as a trampoline. Just make sure you can do it on the trampoline, then take it off of this. You might want to practice it, like doing it a few times, just onto the mattress by itself. And then after you have that down, you can take it right off the mattress. All right, up, fall back, tuck, and land, right? Easy as that. All right, boys, now Jacob's going to try it. Since he's never done a backflip on flat, we're going to get him a backflip on flat. So, you know, you might want to, I mean, you can if you I'll want to. Just uh, take it like that. Exactly. There you go. Just. Is that high enough? Yeah, it's perfect. Yeah. Just right. throw it back. I'm about to throw it back. Just throw it. Just throw it. <laughs> hey, look. There you go. That wasn't bad. All right, now take it off the edge. Hold on. Let me do. No, do we said do a couple of them. Well, you're you. You know how to backflip feels. So. I know, but I want to like. Bro, that's perfect. Now just take it off the edge. All right. You want to focus on your height more than you get out. Because yeah. if you get too far out, then you're not then you're going to go too far out, but you're not going to land a flip because, you know, you're too far out. Yeah. And you won't have height. There you go. All right. You could honestly go higher. Higher? Or straighter, like straight up and down more. Yeah, straight up and down. Instead of like flying back, which you're not, I'm just saying. Yeah, that was perfect. Yeah, here, hold this. I want to. I just, I just remembered a pro tip, a pro pro tip. So what I was telling Jacob is what I mean by go back is like. So when you throw a backflip, I don't want you to like launch yourself back. You see how I had no height. So the difference between those is instead of like, like um, what's the word? Like I guess throwing my butt, my butt back and my back back instead of like this and not throwing your arms up. You want to do this. You want to go up. That's how you get your height. 
and then your knees are your flips. So watch me go up before I even do a flip. Gotta go up. All right, so um, I know a lot of people do this. I, I did this first learning, but my recommendation, okay. so after from taking it to the, from the trampoline to the mattress, to the ground, you're gonna wanna start on a little bit of a hill. It can be a lot, like, it can be steeper than this, obviously, because I can do backflips. I don't need a hill. It's not, that, it's a little steep, it's but it's a little it, bit of a hill. Yeah. So, it's just easier to do it down the hill since it's slanted, so you have a little bit more time to land. So, I know a lot of people do this. So, they step with their dominant, like, uh, the dominant foot in the front, right? If you're right-handed, you step with your right in the front. If you're left-handed, you step with your left in the front, right? So, if you're right-handed, like I am, you're going to want to put your front leg back, step back, and then place, so let me do that again. So it's right leg back, and then left, place, and then jump. That gives you more momentum than just a regular standing back foot. So it gives you a little bit more height, just a little bit, to where like beginners can learn how to do back foot. So let me show you what it looks like. So you're gonna go back, left, and then, and then do a back foot. If you were left-handed, you wanna go left back, right place, and do it. So this is what it looks like. That's what a lot of people do that don't have a, like an actual backflip down yet. They do that to get high. But with me, since I know how to do them, I don't need to. So let's see how Jacob does. Exactly like that. Now you just gotta- you, Remember to keep up and tuck. Yeah, you don't wanna be afraid. Cause if, you, if you're afraid and you're already gonna, doing gonna it, like. you're, gonna, you're gonna bail out and you're gonna land gonna on your neck. You see, you don't want to be scared. Yeah, you guys, you don't want to be scared to do it. Because if you do, if you go for the flip and you're doing it like in midair and then you freak out, no, you're going to like let go and flip around and then you're just like scorpion. That's what you don't want. You want to keep holding your knees. You want to keep that tuck tight. You want to make sure you jump high and up, all right? All right, here we go. Oh my. Oh, first try. <laughs> first backflip. Holy crap, first backflip he's ever tried on ground, perfectly landed it. Well then again, because he has been jumping on the trampoline for like over 10 years, we obviously know how to backflip, we obviously know what it feels like. So, I mean, I don't blame him for landing it, but still, he's never learned it. That's my so. first time ever landing it flat. Yo, you're perfect. All right, now do it flat. Yeah, yeah. All right, one more time, and then it's nice. going to be flat. Yes. Okay, now it's just flat. All righty, here we go. First, first ever backflip about to happen here. Got this. Yes. Oh. Nice. Dude, this is awesome, dude. Like, you get that like chill in your in like in your. That like, you've arms. learned new flip. Oh. It's okay because you were doing it a little bit up of a hill because it's I was, like I was it was. Going, I'm going up. He was, now, yeah, he did the, the yeah. <laughs> Would you look at that? Cha ching! Yes. All right, guys, the rain's starting to pick up pretty heavy right now. We got we got the. I learned I learned a backflip, guys. I learned a freaking backflip. Like, give me a round of applause for that. But uh, anyways, we hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Hopefully, Eli is a good teacher to you guys. Um, everyone can do backflip if you work for it. I swear. Eli, Eva knows, I know now. Um, but yeah, all right guys, here comes the rain. Um, we'll see you guys next time. And that's a wrap.